What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Omega Ruby walkthrough. Okay, so in our last episode, we defeated our, uh, our good ol' uh, girlfriend, Flannery. You know, with one Pokemon. And uh, now, we went with the other girlfriend, May. Yes, we do have multiple girlfriends and all that stuff, so my bad. And uh, we're back here in Petalburg, because we're going to be battling our daddy right now. So... I did say that we're going to bring back our old buddy, a good old buddy of ours. And that good old buddy of ours happens to be Yokozuna. That's right, the fighting type Pokemon that grew to level 26 a little too quickly. Yeah, that Pokemon right there. And I did teach him uh, well, two new moves, Smackdown and Bulldoze. Yeah, we're going to have some fun right here. We're really, really going to have some fun. So here we go. We're going to be going straight to the gym. And uh, we're going to be talking to the man that... The only man that's ever believed in this right here. So let's see. What do you have to say? Yo, how's it going, champ to be Draven? The doors in this gym open to uh, open when you beat the awaiting trainers. Whoops. The doors in the room are already open, so don't attack me. The trainers of the per uh, Petalburg gym all use kind or all use all kinds of items. The door at the left leads to the speed room. The door on the right leads to the accuracy room. The room uh, the room's names will be on the uh, on the door so choose wisely once you've got once you've chosen the door well hey go for it okay all right and you guys already know i'm gonna be battling everybody everybody why because i can and uh well let's see i know that i switched at well the pokemon that i switched uh out for yokozuna was uh was raiden because doesn't really have the attacks that it would actually go for in this one. And I know that I'm like replacing a little bit of speed for power, but it's for the benefit of the team right here because eventually, you know, once we take care of this and then uh, the desert, we'll be able to capture whatever Pokemon we want. Trust me, guys, it's going to get very, very interesting coming into the following episode. So well, let's go ahead and talk to this guy right here. Being able to attack before an opponent? That confers a great advantage in battle. Wouldn't you agree? That is true. That is very, 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 very true. All right, here we go. Ace Trainer Randall would like to battle, and he's coming out with his Delcaddy. Now, most of these trainers have normal type Pokemon, but like uh, old boy right here was telling us, they like to use items. They like to use X attack, speed, accuracy, what have you. You know, just to get a heads up on me. But what I'm going to do right here is I'm going to go with the vital uh, throw. And I'm going to make sure that uh, I make these people remember the name Yokozuna. Look at that. And it's good too because uh, Yokozuna does have a high, very, very high attack. And uh, look at that. Claymore growing levels right here and it's learning roar. But I am not going to teach you that. Okay, so there we go. And uh, Randall has been defeated. Yeah, buddy. Okay, so that right there is done. Zero de reduction and defense room. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the other room and I'm going to be battling everybody there. So let's go straight to this room right here. The accuracy room. And of course, they would like to use the X accuracy right here. So let's go right ahead and take care of this lady right here. Hehehe, <laughs> this is the accuracy room. It's pretty nasty when every attack lands without fail. That is true. If you guys don't remember... You know, Pokemon Black, I do have a good old buddy of mine that likes to miss a lot of attacks. So here we go, Ace Trainer Mary coming out with her Delcaddy. Eh, well, well, we'll see what happens right here. Yokozuna. Look at that. It's been a while. I missed you, buddy. Go ahead, have at it. Destroy everybody. And uh, a little bit of an advantage for me right there. The Quick Claw. About to kick your ass. Here we go. Vital Throw. Oh, wow, nearly beats this guy right here. So let's go again. One more vital throw. And look at that. The quick claw is just going... F Wait, I thought I was going to go fast. What the hell? This, 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 this pussy is giving me the layeth to smack it down. And here we go. Vital throw. Yeah, buddy. So no more Delcaddy. And Yokozuna, of course, gets more uh, points. And uh, Ace Trainer Mary has been defeated. Cut above me. See, I didn't really need those moves or anything like that. Alrighty, the defense room and the recovery room. So, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go to the defense room because that will eventually lead us back to the other room right here. So, 
let's go right in here and take care of the business right now. Let's go ahead. Ah, another pretty lady right here. Let's see what you have to say. The higher my Pokemon's defense, the more reckless I can be with my attacks. Okay. Bring it on. Lori would like to battle, and she's coming out with her, uh, l with her, uh, uh Lanoon right here. Okay. Alrighty. Alrighty. Okay, so, let's see what your defense can do with the power-up punch right here. Look at that. Quick Claw, move first, defense, and here we go. Power-up punch. I'm gonna increase my attack just a little bit. Look at that. Here we go again, another power-up punch. Come on. And here we go again. Power up punch does the trick. You see, I have tricks of my own. I know Pokemon. And uh, look at that. Level 27. It's not, it's like he never messed a step. Oh my god. And Vesuvius, level 28. So technically, I pray, like I don't think I really need my other Pokemon right here. I think you've taught me a valuable lesson here. Go on. The left room leads to the strength room. The other room leads to the KO room. Okay. Alrighty, so we're gonna be going out here, and we've already battled you, so let's go right here, and what is this room? Zero reduction room. Okay. Alrighty, so this guy right here will probably lead to my dad. Don't even waste your time trying to lower my Pokemon stats! Ah, uh, so that's what it means. Okay, so here we go. Parker would like to battle. And he's coming with the Lanoon. Alright, yeah, crazy ass Lanoon. Here comes Yokozuna. Okay, Yokozuna. Uh, let's go with the Vital Throw. Kind of want to finish this guy off. Look at that. The Quick Claw is kicking ass right now. And well, I see what that guard spec can do, but here we go. Vital Throw never misses. Nearly takes out Lanoon. Let's go with Bulldoze. And, uh, oh wow, there, there's that COVID attack. And, uh... Stole my Quick Claw, so here we go. And uh, that takes care of that. Okay. Alrighty. Okay. Alrighty. And uh, Claymore grows to level 20. Hydra 2, level 34. And Gaia number, or Gaia number 1, level 31. Remember last episode, two Pokemon evolved. It's pretty freaking awesome right here. Okay, the next room is the Strength Room. Can you withstand the Brute Force? Oh, okay. The... The, the the strength room so let's let's go back down right here and uh, let's take care of other businesses right here we got business to take care of to tend to and all that crud right here and uh, well let's see I think we've already done this uh, let's see recovery room did they already recover I think so oh yeah he didn't oh they never recovered okay Let's go right ahead and uh, heal our Pokemon because he deserves it or she deserves it. Yokozuna is a girl. Holy crap. I completely forgot about that. So let's go ahead and battle. Just when you think you're going to win, your opponent restores his HP. It's such a terrible feeling. I think I'll let you see for yourself. <laughs> go ahead. Try for it. Okay, here we go. Ace Trainer George would like to battle and he's coming out with a Lanoon. Okay. Let's get this. Let's get this. I, I'm pretty sure I can win right here. Alright, power up punch. It's gonna do its thing. And, uh, okay, why would you be using a mud sport? I don't know. I just sent my electric type Pokemon to the PC. You do know that, right? Yeah. And here we go again. Another power up punch. That's right. Go, go, Power Rangers, power punch. And there goes Lanoon. Defeated. Oh, yes. And, uh, well, there goes George. He's like, I couldn't restore my HP enough. What a, what attack power. <laughs> I'm just using strategy, buddy. Okay, so let's see. Well, that's not the whole story. A trainer's skills are a result of effort and work. I lost to you because I didn't put enough effort. Go on. The next room is the one-hit KO room. Ah. You want to bet? You want to challenge that? Okay, so here we go. One-hit KO. And uh, let's see what this guy has to say. I'm not going to take it easy on you just because you're the leader's kid. I'll show you how horrible it is for a Pokemon to take a critical hit. Uh, okay, well, here we go. Burke would like to battle, and he's coming out with the Zangoose. Okay, 
Let's see what Zangoose can do. Okay. Zangoose is a Pokemon of critical hit, so you gotta be careful for that guy. And here they come out with a dire hit. And let's go with a power up punch. It increases my attack right here. So let's go again. Another power up punch. And uh, this guy. Oh, wow. Now that was a critical hit. Yeah, well, at least there was one person that actually fulfilled its uh, its promise. Oh, jeez. Okay. And look at that. Yokozuna. Level 28. Its attack is going through the roof right there. And Sage of the Halo, not doing anything, but yeah. Level 37. Okay, so... Since brilliance, father and son. Okay, so the next room will be my dad. I wonder what this room would be. Oh, okay, we've already been here, so let's go right up here. And, uh... Okay, so I don't think I've defeated this girl right now, and, uh... Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Heal up my Pokemon because, again, somebody actually fulfilled their promise. Okay, let's go. Our gym leader told us to pull out all the stops to beat you. Even if you even if you do happen to be the leader's own son. Wow, these guys are like bitter. These guys are bitter and whatever. So here we go. Jody would like to battle. And here we go. Okay. Okay, so here we go. Zangoosey wants the battle. Let's go with the vital throw. And uh, yes, we are faster than you, but they're going to be increasing their attack just a little bit more. And let's go. Vital throw takes them out. No more Zangoose. You know, at one point, I actually wanted to capture Zangoose for the team. Turns out, nope. Nope. Yep, not, the, not a proper Pokemon at all. The way you handle your Pokemon reminds me of your father's style. Go on through. The gym leader, no. Your father is waiting. <laughs> oh, finally, acknowledging my daddy, huh? Okay, says the gym leader's room. See for yourself if your Pokemon awaits. Do you want to enter? Fuck yeah. All right, I'm going to kick down that door. I was like, hey, Pops. Yeah, that's right. You owe me a gym battle. Look at that. He's meditating. Oh yeah, he, he senses that I'm here. He smells my B.O. and all that crud. Just like my real dad. Hmm. So did you get four badges? Then as I promise, we will have a Pokemon battle. Oh damn. He like rose up like the Undertaker right here. Okay, okay, I see how it is. Okay, he wants all the smoke. I'm gonna give him the smoke and uh, we're gonna level up our Pokemon. No, not level up, but you know what I mean. Okay, let's get this. What's up? It's me, your son. Okay, okay, okay. Draven? It makes me happier than I uh, can really describe. Being able to have a real battle with my own son like this? But a battle is a battle. I will do everything within my power as a gym leader to win. You better, you better give it your best shot, too, Draven. Oh, damn. He's turning Super Saiyan! Okay, okay, okay. Here we go. Gym battle number five against our daddy, Norman. And here he comes out with a slacking. Now, remember, slacking. Very physical attacker. So we're going tank against tank. Lazy man versus slow girl. Oh, yeah. Yokozuna. Let's go. Right here. Let's go with the power up punch. Yeah, we gotta increase these attacks right here first. And, uh, wow! Retaliate does its thing right there. And luckily for us, Slacking actually takes a. It actually, take a, it actually takes a break in the next one. So, let's go right ahead and use a vital throw. Destroy this guy right here. Oh, yes. And that takes care of that guy. Okay, alrighty. Yokozuna kicks some ass. Level 29. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. And uh, Claymore. Yeah, that guy. Claymore and Vesuvius. And Vesuvius is learning Curse, but I'm going to keep the moves right here. Alrighty. And uh, he's going to be coming out with a Vigoroth. I'm going to stay put right here with Yokozuna. I'm pretty sure I could uh, take care of myself right here. Now, Vigoroth is the complete opposite of uh, Slacking. High attack, but it's very, very... Uh, 
very, very energetic. As you can see, it's kicking my ass right now, but here it comes the power-up punch. Now I got two boosts. So what I'm going to try and do right here is I'm actually going to try and heal my Pokemon. Don't want it to faint. I don't want to bring it in here for no reason whatsoever. So let's see. Oh, crud. I didn't bring a... Well, I don't have a Hyper Potion. So let's go with a Super Potion right here. Ah, it looks like our dad did the same thing. Okay, so he thought he thought this through. Okay. Bring it on. I think another Hyper or another Power Up Punch can do this because it will actually... Let's see, retaliate. Okay, so that didn't take much, but that was a critical hit. But here we go, power up punch. Finishes off Vigoroth. Okay. Look at that. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is the this is this is how we're doing it right here. Look at that. And uh wow, Hydra number two is finally learning a water type move. <laughs> and a move that I'm probably not gonna be using, so uh Eh, screw it. I'm gonna take away Bite Attack for right now. Remember, guys, uh, something happens after this whole thing. And uh, look at that. We got ourselves Aqua Tail. And he's gonna be coming out with his final Pokemon, Slacking. And this guy's gonna be a lot more stronger and a lot more faster. So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna give it another potion right here. That way it can feel the full force of Yokozuna's throw. Alrighty. And uh, here we go with the what? What was it? Oh sh snap! What the hell? What the? What the hell is that? Oh wait, 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 wait! Hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah, okay. I was gonna use another freaking potion, but I realized it's lacking. It's gonna doze off for the next one. So let's go with Vital Throw, and it's using Truant. So it's loafing around, and here we go. Vital Throw for the win. Suck it, Dad. Oh, yeah. And rightfully so, Yokozuna grows a level 30. Look at that, and it wants to learn smelting salts. Or smelling salt. So, whatever. Let's see, what does this do? Uh, this attacks double damage on his targets with paralysis. This also cures targets paralysis, however. What the hell? Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Yeah. No. Okay, yeah. Alrighty, so there you go, guys. Claymore grows to level 22. And, uh, let's see. Iron Head, it's learning Iron Head, okay. Look at that. Pokemon are learning some good moves, so I'm gonna switch it out. I'm just gonna switch out Metal Claw and all that crud. And there we go. And look at that, we defeated our daddy. Impossible. <laughs> I beat you, Dad. Suck it. I can't believe it! I lost to Draven! You've come this far, but you're grounded. That's what my dad would say. And that's how it is then. I will give you this! Look at that, guys. Ain't that a beaut? We got ourselves the balance badge. Suck it, Dad. Having the balance badge will ensure that your Pokemon up to level 60 will obey you even if you receive them in trades. Pokemon who know the HM move Surf will also be able to obey you or tr to travel all over the water. And this is my gift to you, Draven. I'm sure you'll be able to use it well. Look at that. TM67, Retaliate. Suck on that. Retaliate will allow you to take advantage of a fallen team member. Oh, no wonder. Its power will be doubled if you have a Pokemon that use it in the next move right after an ally faints. Okay, I hope you and your Pokemon are diligent enough to use it wisely. Oh my god, my dad is like, he's, he, low-key, he's kind of pissed off that we beat him. <sighs> oh damn. As a gym leader, I can't express how frustrated I am. But as a father, it makes me feel both good or happy and a little sad. It's odd. That's what you call a bittersweet feeling, dude. That's what you call a bittersweet feeling. Oh yeah, come on, Draven. I'll see you on your way out. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Oh, look at that. We're not grounded. We're not really grounded. And right after you get out the gym, would you look at that? It's our good old buddy, Super Saiyan Three, Wally. Draven, Mr. Norman. Oh damn. I haven't seen you two, uh, you two of, uh, or I haven't seen the two of you in some time. What a coincidence. 
I just came back to, to my parents' house to grab something I'd forgotten. You look like you'd been working hard, Wally. It's clear to uh, it's clear it's clear even without a battle. R really? You think so? Hey, <laughs> thank you. That's so nice of you to say. Ah, Draven, isn't it? I'm glad to see you here. I'm Wally's father, of course. As you can see, Wally health, uh, Wally's health has thor uh, thoroughly improved. All thanks uh, to you and your father. You two helped Wally catch his first Pokemon that day. It's because of you that he has a partner of his own now. That partner is why he's uh, grown so strong, and that's my firm belief. So I thank you. Oh, wow. Yes, that's it. Sometimes words aren't enough. It would delight me if you take this. Throwing out the peace sign, guys. Throwing out the peace sign. Look at that. HMO3 Surf. Finally. If, you, uh, if you're if you clear to, uh, to use Surf outside battle, you'll be able to cross the seas with your Pokemon. Draven. Considering how much you and Wally have grown, you should be able to handle uh, what lies beyond uh, the sea out on Route 118 now. There are far stronger Pokemon and trainers waiting on you on the east on the east coast. Continue your journey and your adventures there. I know you'll do your best. Yes, sir. I will do my best to become as strong as Draven, sir. I guess I had better start out. Then I'm out. I'm off now, Dad. See you next time. Um. Come on, Draven, let's go together. Wally, I look forward to seeing you and your Pokemon grow stronger together. Draven, fuck off. <laughs> well, that's what that's what my dad would say. Well, take care of yourself out there. Don't forget to drop by uh, Little Route to visit your mother from time to time. Okay, we're off. Be safe out there. I'll learn a lot. Alrighty, so we're leaving right here and, uh, well... A father's monologues right here. Look at that. Da -da -da -dot. Da -da -da -dot. I don't know what it is, but hmm. Seeing my little boy all grown up and going off on his own as a father, it makes me feel happy and a little sad. <laughs> what a coincidence! I caught myself thinking the same thing. <laughs> is that so? But if only. If only my boy keeps growing strong and healthy like that, I wouldn't ask for anything else. Yes, I know exactly what you mean. Damn, father's monologue. Well, my dad would have said just, you know, whatever, I don't know. I think he said the same thing when I, like, uh, I moved out. <laughs> Mr. Norman told us to keep going beyond Route 118, didn't he? Let me check my area nav. Oh, dang. 118 is the one east of Malville City, huh? Draven, since we're both in, or we're both here anyways, let's go to Malville together. I'm definitely planning on going to check out Route 118 like your dad said. Oh, damn. Okay, so we're walking, we're going, and here we are in Malville, and he's like, whew. It's actually pretty far, isn't it? All the way out here on Malville? So, that must be Route 118 ahead. I, know, I wonder what kind of Pokemon I'll meet out there. I can't wait to find out. I'll see you there. I'll see you later, Draven. I'm going straight to one uh, Route 118. Let's definitely have a battle next time we meet. It's a promise, okay? And you can't break a promise. Eh, well, you you don't you really don't know who I am. <laughs> okay, alrighty. So, we're gonna be sneaking in. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Two step, two step. Yep, let's go. Okay, so we finally got five badges, guys. Five freaking badges, and, uh. Yeah, you would think that I'm gonna be going to the east coast of Hoenn right now, but now we do have the ability to surf, and there is one little tidbit that we need to do. One little thing. We're going to be going north from here, and we're going to actually go to the desert and see what's up there, and then uh, go rest at my own, my, 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 my little uh, secret base area and all that crud. Uh, I believe within the next, I would like to say a few episodes, I'm going to be taking side quests from time to time, guys. I'm going to be side questing all over the place, guys. So, going to the east coast is going to take a backseat right here, so, yeah. Not only that, guys, 
I am now enabled to capture whatever Pokemon I want. Actually, I was always enabled to capture whatever Pokemon I wanted. The thing was, I wanted to save it until the fifth gym badge because I didn't want to level up my Pokemon too high and I didn't want to evolve my Pokemon off screen and all that stuff. I know many of you guys wanted to see me evolve my Pokemon in Liquid Crystal. So I decided, you know what, screw it, let's do it for uh, Omega Ruby since you guys are doing so great at watching my walkthroughs right here, especially in Omega Ruby. So what I'm going to do is uh, the next episode, I'm going straight to the desert, figure that whole thing out. And then after that, I'm going to be capturing a buttload of Pokemon, trading a buttload of Pokemon. And uh, yeah, I will be showing you guys the Pokemon I trade from uh, game to game. If you guys don't remember, I do have the Alpha Zapphire copy copy and uh, I will be trading some Pokemon that you've known for quite some time too so with that being said thank you guys for watching I will see you guys in the next episode when we go to the desert see you guys